I might have got Chicago. Only way to keep calm is trouble worlds have a serene mind, you know. Uh, still in this wide awake nightmare. Uh, I got to remember, I got to say this. Eight million people die worldwide from cigarettes. 480,000 die in the United States from cigarettes. Alcohol kills over 3.2 million people every day. I mean, every, every year, 3.2 million. Every 10 seconds, an alcoholic dies from alcohol. Every six seconds, a person dies from cigarettes. So guns kill, gun violence kills 250,000 people every year. So, you know, uh, sunny day today outside in Chicago, uh, it's 40 degrees, kind of cool outside, but uh, we're gonna play a bad hand well. <clears throat> so we'll see, see at the end of the month if they're gonna do some kind of, we're still in social distance in this city. Some states talking about opening up, but Chicago, we still uh, social distance. Uh, you know, God is open, stores are closed, a beautiful day in the sunshine in Chicago. And I'll pause before the penitentiary. And I'm just wearing this world like a loose garment, still out in the sunshine of the spirit, you know, Lord, enjoying life in the here and now. Just come from all this, got me some groceries in. You know, everybody's like uh, in a, in a horror, horror movie, everybody's scared and person coming here, everybody's full of, wearing a lot of masks, masks, you know, uh, like a Halloween, uh, Lucifer type of witchcraft movie. But uh, I'm enjoying life today. Uh, just doing my walking. Uh, uh, good people walk on whatever happens to them. So wear the world like a loose garment. I'm not. I'm not caught up in the news. Uh, the numbers of the how many people dying. Like I said, 150,000 people gonna die every day worldwide. That's part of life. You know, everybody wants to go to heaven. No one wants to die. So if I'm alive. You know, I got. I got to be the best I can in the, in the here and now. Enjoy life. You know, fears a curse. Fears a curse the world. Fears everywhere. Everybody's afraid. You know, from the. Uh, person driving the bus, the person uh, bagging groceries, everybody's got gloves and hands and just jumping when the person comes into the store. The hermit life's not a normal life, so the depopulation uh, is social distance, is a world of isolation. I mean, everybody, you know, they, you know, when a person comes into the store, it's like a human being coming, they jump, you know, people, for, people are afraid of people. And uh, so we're going to see in, in May, is this going to, some of the states going to try to open up and just uh, try to bring the society back together because, uh, uh, everybody's hurting financially, you know, and they also hurting spiritually because people are sitting in isolation. They're on Instagram, drinking and drugging, partying like rock stars. And uh, a lot of people are getting sick because, see, basically, uh, alcohol takes uh, vitamins out of a person's uh, body. When a person put a person in detox, I took up uh, counseling back in the day, and they tell you that they give a person alcohol vitamins because alcohol is full of sugar, carbohydrates, and that's why you got people's resistance is down, immune system is down because alcohol robs you of your vitamins. Even though it's a billion dollar business, alcohol is still being sold right now. You know, you can go buy alcohol right now. They bring it to you, bring it to your house, put it in the store. So I'm glad, like I say, to be sober. Uh, I don't drink. I was drugs. You know, 31 years. I ain't gambling, and I'm enjoying life. I'm in the sun. I'm out here in this beautiful sunshine. Sun is full of vitamins. So breathe. Uh, Deep breathing, walk, uh, wear the world like loose garment. The mind should be nowhere, nowhere in particular. My mind is not on the world news. I, my mind is not on the old girl. My mind is not on the old girlfriend. My, nine, my, my mind is on the uh, beauty, beauty of what's around me right now. Beautiful, beautiful sun. Uh, you know, gravity is going to be gravity, you know, because it's God's creation. The sun is going to shine when it's God tell you. So God's creation, the beauty around me. So it's a good day to be above ground. Uh, uh, April the, uh, it's April the 16th. Probably about 11.20. Like I said, it's a cool day in Chicago, but spring is trying to, one day we'll get here when uh, the wickedness kind of like, uh, <laughs> kind of like slows down, you know. So the peace that comes from God passes all understanding. See, the world can't give it to me, uh, can't take it from me, you know. And God is good, you know, all the time. The church was closed on Easter. The ministers would walk around, you know, uh, they were closed, but God was open. You know, God is the greatest servant. He's always there, you know. So I pray to be calm and let nothing upset me. I pray to not allow those about me spoil my peace of mind. I pray to be calm in the midst of the storm. So God is God is our power, and He's given me the peace. Be calm in the midst of whatever happening, because uh, I wear this world like loose garment. You know, pray to be calm and let nothing upset me. Pray to not allow those, allow those about me spoil my peace of mind. Dogs will bark. You know, dogs gonna bark. Kids are gonna cry at the movie theater. So you know, great man, complete at ease. Petty men always on the edge. So I'm not on the edge today. I mean, I'm, I'm happy, joyous, and free. You know, uh, my happiness comes from within. It's a relationship with a God who created, who created this universe. Uh, everybody wants to go to heaven. No one wants to die. You know, don't be scared. You talking about you want to go to heaven. Don't be scared. We, we your time to go. It's your time to go. So 
Uh, be the best you can right now, you know. Uh, you got false prophets going around. They got churches closed on Easter, you know. You know, they could have did tents. They could have they could have opened the church and, and did uh, social distance. You could have the churches open and you could have fed 10 people. I fed a homeless man last, uh, I, I fed a homeless man last, I gave some man, a homeless man last night on my journey. Man was out there, I gave him some change. You know, help the person in front of you. How are you going to open a church and and you got all that money from those grandmamas that put they put money in your churches? Now you're closed. You know you're closed. You know so you could have ten people in that church, and uh, you could have fed ten people. So like I said, I'm glad to be uh, in the truth. I'm not sleepwalking through life. I can see I know fake from real. You know I come from a lifestyle of a smoke and mirror. So my Scott Chicago, cool to be a square. Paul before the penitentiary. I must control my emotion. My emotion will control me. So glad to be alive today. Happy joys to the free.